My name is Miguel Jimenez, and I'm an assistant professor in the Department of Biomedical Engineering at Boston University. I became an engineer and a scientist because I really love building and making. Uh, at home, I like woodworking and making furniture. Uh, so at work, I get to build instead with molecules and cells, as well as polymers. Uh, we use cutting edge techniques, and these techniques allow us to make devices that, to monitor and control biological processes, both in our bodies, as well as in the environment. I'm particularly passionate about developing technologies that are that work and are designed specifically for use in low resource settings. Um, as a society, I think we've developed some incredible tools to analyze our world, but by and large, these are confined to labs, factories, and hospitals, which is great. Uh, but what we're asking is how can we uh, develop tools to test infectious agents, for example, uh, as easily as taking a photo with your phone? Or for example, could we make tools that allow us to monitor and improve plant root health simply through scanning tags buried in the soil? So our group is focused on developing electronic and mechanical devices that natively interface with biology. Uh, for example, sensors and actuators with onboard microorganisms that have augment our capacity to monitor and act on changes, for example, in our bodies, plants and livestock, and even our environment. So we're a new group and we're really focused on solving sort of three foundational challenges for this new area of microbial devices. Uh, first, we're asking the question, how can we keep these onboard cells alive for up to a whole year? Two, how can we ensure the robust function of their genetic circuits despite cell replication and a potentially changing external environment? And lastly, we're very interested in what are all the ways we can transfer information between cells and these devices that might be more efficient uh, more, or more effective.